welcome back to my channel and I am now back home as you can tell I'm in my regular background and I'm gonna be filming for you guys my March favorites and I'm just gonna jump right into it so I don't make a long intro um, I'm gonna start off with my Aveeno ultra calming makeup remover wipes and you guys know I had this in my recent empties video and I totally love these wipes they're really good um, it says that they gently soothe and cleanse, removing dirt and makeup, even mascara. And I do like these, as I had said in my empties video. Um, these remove your makeup effectively. They're not totally saturated. They're not totally dry. And um, they're very good for sensitive skin, which is what I have. So I really enjoy these. So that's that. Next thing is my Vaseline Spray and Go Moisturizer. And um, this to me, and I have it in Pure Oat Extract and Stratus. It's Total Moisture Non-Greasy. And I love this thing, guys. Um, I'm like so lazy when it comes to applying lotion. Um, I go and apply to my legs and the rest is like whatever. So to me, this is like a total lifesaver. I just spray and it blends in perfectly it works amazing for me so i love this stuff and i totally recommend it they have different kinds they have a green one and i believe i'm not sure if it's like an orange one or something like that i believe the green one's like aloe or something like that but this is the one i got and so far i love it the next thing i'm loving is my foundation that it's a new foundation that i'm using and it's the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12-Hour Full Coverage Foundation with SPS, SPF 15. And mine, does it have the color on it? It doesn't. And I don't have the box with me. But this is what it looks like. I believe mine is like light to medium, something like that. And it's, it's oil-free makeup, long wear makeup. And um, the next favorite is obviously the brush that I'm applying it with. And it's also from Tarte. And I totally love this, guys. This um, foundation is amazing. I don't have to put so much on where I'm like caking a whole bunch of foundation on to have it cover and look nice. This totally makes my skin look flawless. And with this brush, it's like the perfect combo. So... I suggest you guys get this <laughs> and I got mine from QVC and I love it my next favorite is um, a new shampoo and conditioner I've been using you guys know that I love my Moroccan oil and this one is pretty much kind of like a sample size and it is the Kiehl's amino acid shampoo and it is for all hair types Right, And then I have the Kiehl's Amino Acid Conditioner with pure coconut and jojoba oils, silicone-free, paraben-free for all hair types. And I had actually gotten these two in a Christmas box um, that had like samples of creams and this shampoo and this conditioner in it. And I love it. Um, I have noticed that after I use this, my hair feels really, really clean, but not only that, it's so soft that when I flat iron it, it doesn't feel like I'm like struggling to get the hair to look nice. It looks all frizzy. It looks all crazy. No, it actually feels really smooth, really nice, and um, I'm really, really liking this. So I already finished with the shampoo. There's only a little bit left there. The conditioner has a little more. So um, I still have some conditioner left and I'm really thinking of buying these full size. So I totally recommend it. I am really, really enjoying the, those this month. Um, my next favorite is a NYX lipstick and I did mention this in my last video in my Ipsy bag. Um, unboxing or opening or haul, whatever you want to call it. And this is NYX. And it's the color I'm wearing right now. And it's in the color 565. It doesn't say a name. And this is what it looks like. It's kind of like a raspberry color. You guys know that I really like colors like this. And um, yeah. So I'm going to swatch it again. Just like I did in the other video. So you guys can see. That's what it looks like. And I'm wearing it today as I said. And I really really enjoy this color. I've been enjoying this a lot. And this I had 
I had it in my makeup collection somewhere and I had totally forgotten that I had it. So it is like a rediscovered item. Um, the next thing that I'm loving is a perfume and it's the Jennifer Aniston one. And I had gotten this before in like a rollerball to try it and I really, really liked it, but I never um, bought the full size because as you guys know, as I've said before, I have millions of perfumes and I switch them up a lot. So, um, but then the other day I came across it and I remembered it, um, you know, in the beginning of the month and I bought it and I bought a small size um, to see if, um, you know, I really liked it again because I didn't remember and I totally love this perfume guys the jennifer aniston perfume is amazing it smells so like it kind of smells like classy it smells clean it smells feminine i don't even know how to explain it but it's an overall amazing perfume i would totally recommend it and then the other perfume that I've been loving, which is also rediscovered, is my Sarah Jessica Parker NYC perfume. And this is what the case looks like, what the bottle looks like. Super cute. And that's how it opens up. And I wore this one of these days in March, and my husband was like, oh my god, I love that. And I've had this for like a couple of years, to tell you the truth. And I got it because he really liked it. One time we went to the store, we tried it out, and he loved it. And I got it because of him. And then the other night, um, I wore it, and he was like, oh my god, I love it. And I was like, oh my god, I had totally forgotten to wear this, and I hadn't worn it anymore. So... Yeah, that's another one that smells amazing. Um, I don't really know how to describe this, guys. All I can tell you, it's a very sexy scent. So that's a, that's why I'm guessing that my husband loves it. <laughs> and then um, my next favorite is this Body Shop Strawberry Shower Gel. And this is like a huge tube. <laughs> And I've only used this much, but I've been using it the whole entire month. So this lasts a really long time. And I really, really, really love this. This is like strawberry in a bottle, seriously. It smells so good. You feel so good when you shower with this. It just smells amazing. It's a, it's a, and I like the body shop a lot better than Bath and Body Works. Some of you might already know that about me. Um, and I really, really love this smell. This is amazing. Now my next favorite is two hair products and um, the reason why I got these two hair products is because I my natural hair is curly. So when I was younger, you know, obviously my hair was virgin, it was my natural color and um, I would just use gel, hairspray, mousse, whatever, and it would be amazing. Beautiful curls, you know, all nice. Of course, when you start dyeing your hair and treating your hair and doing all this type of stuff it gets to the point where it doesn't want to curl anymore or it doesn't want to curl nicely it stays frizzy like at the ends especially which is where i have you know like the blonder parts of the hair and um i got this and i'm like well let me just try it out because everybody talks about the big um big sexy hairline so this is curly sexy hair and i got the curling cream and the curl power spray foam and it's a curl enhancer and the this one is a curling cream and they work very very well together i really really enjoyed it um i used it maybe i didn't use it a lot this month but i really enjoyed it when i used it and um i would get out of the shower use the cream um let it dry some and then i would use the foam and it was Awesome. I really, really liked what it did to my hair. It curled nice, didn't look frizzy, didn't look dry, weird. Because, you know, that frizzy hair that just, like, stays, like, all really weird like that. I don't even know how to explain it. But um, I imagine that you guys understand what I mean. It just stays, like, really nasty. Just, you know, whatever. It won't curl. It won't do anything. It'll just stay like that. So I recommend these, and um, I've really enjoyed them the times that I used them this month. Now, I do have um, two like random favorites and one of them is a food favorite and I've been asking myself why I was ever introduced to this because now it's like an obsession and it's Nutella. And a lot of you are probably going to be like, what? You were just introduced to this? And yes, guys, I was just recently introduced to this, okay? Um, Nutella is a hazelnut spread with skim milk and cocoa. 
and it's just a chocolate spread and what happens is that um, I had never tried it before and I did see people raving about it on YouTube and people raving about it everywhere else but I never really thought about trying it because um, I just thought it was like a regular chocolate spread that it was just gonna taste like any you know whatever chocolate and I wasn't really interested but no it's hazelnut it's what's inside of those Ferrer Rocher whatever you call them chocolates my god it is so good guys just getting a uh, like a piece of toast like that and spreading it on the toast <gasps> amazing getting strawberries and doing chocolate covered strawberries with this amazing so yeah I'm in love with this and I totally recommend it <laughs> and then my last um, favorite is my new Erin Condren Life Planner and I did get it personalized with my family's picture. I don't know if you guys can see it. That's me, my husband, and my two boys and I am so in love with this planner. I'm going to do a video um, and another video like just speaking about this and taking you inside so you can see what it looks like and I did get on top the Levy family which is our last name. And that's a picture of us. And then it has a nice little bookmark where you can put inside the planner. And then, you know, this is pretty much the inside, which I guess I'm going to discuss in another video. But I really, really enjoy this because I think it's an awesome planner to keep you organized, especially if you're a mom or if you have a family where you have to be scheduling a bunch of things. Like my kids, they do sports, they do piano, they do a bunch of stuff. And my husband and I have millions of appointments and taking care of things for the business and things like that. So um, I really, really enjoy this planner. So um, if you guys do want to see that video, let me know down below. Um, but I will be filming it anyways so you guys can see what um, the life planner looks inside and how it works and see if you guys would like that. Um, so that's it for my March favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And please like, subscribe, and comment as usual down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.